Hello again. I just wanted to speak to you very quickly about my friend Wally. He's uh, He was an acquired toy from a friend and uh, I basically took him apart, stripped out his insides with the intention of maybe, you know, get him moving around by himself, avoiding obstacles and the like, but um, there's not a lot of room in there when you start stripping out the plastic casing and everything. And to be honest, it was a great deal of messing around with the little uh, circuits and whatever, trying to get the most out of this little chap as possible. In the end, I just decided to keep it nice and simple. Got a ping sensor there, an Arduino Nano in, and just installed a little switch that you probably can't see. Is it focusing? Probably not. Um, and there too. Um, and yeah, after a lot of fun and games of... Um, shoehorning it all in and doing a last minute test and soldering as well. Soldering is so hard for me and I have no idea why. I'm absolutely rubbish at it but um, we got there eventually and uh, no glue gun used in this whole project which is good because I always end up using it to to patch things that which I've bodged. But anyway, here he is. He's like a little room, uh, room guard. You hit the switch and anything that comes into close proximity, he sounds an alarm. Beep, beep, get out of my room. Beep, 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 beep. And what's really clever, just switch him off, is that he has a little timer in there. And when you switch it on, the timer activates and it records um, uh, the instances where the beam is broken and it records it as variables, and you just plug it in, and you can view the history. I haven't quite worked out how to save it to SD card, which would be brilliant, but I'm working on it. But, um, yeah, it sort of does the job that I want to, recording the uh, recording the data, but um, not in a very efficient way. But anyway, from me, and Wally, see you later. Bye.